Foot like a bee, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2 on the UK map. We're following this class 1A in Transport for Wales livery as it arrives in Hollyhead. Now, we actually need to connect. Oh, Hollyhead is connected via road. We could probably get that bridge under there. And I'm quite happy for it to build anywhere over here, really. Uh, but as the title suggests, today we're gonna do a cleanup episode. There, this is gonna been this has been coming for a long time because the map is in uh, is in a fair state of affairs. Really, that's the only way to <laughs> sort of put it. So there's uh, lots of things I need to sort of add and do. Uh, first of all, though, I would like to add that Avanti West Coast train that heads up there should now be two of these on here no there's only one so i need to release a second one of those okay 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 and we'll perhaps release it down here so first thing on list add another one of these now Someone did mention that there was not really any electrification up uh, in Wales, really, at all, uh, north and south. But I'm just going to leave it. I may, this may be something that we sort of clean up, as one might say. But there's a lot of stuff we need to clean up, clean up industries, buses, some train routes here and there, etc. Now... I was going to add that, but what I'm going to do is go to here, right, find transport for wheels, uh, a hallway head to crew, manage vehicle, and I want to, I just want to duplicate this one, yes, mass clone all vehicles, it's not really a mass clone, it's just one, one clone, it should be popping out here, because this is the nearest and sort of, sort of best depot for it to really do so. Now we need to release the other transport for Wales uh, one here. So this is transport for Wales the other class 1A. So where's TFW? TFW Holyhead to Birmingham. So let's release that as well and then that continue out go on its merry way. Right I need to delete this depot as well so I will remember to do so. So that train is on its way, right? We can now do, however, the Avanti West Coast train that goes to London, Houston. Now, I don't know where I'm going to launch it from. Hopefully, what is going on there? What is that? Oh. That was weird. See there? We did a bit, we did a, bit a slight bit of cleaning up there. Right, so there are a few trains that are wandering through this station. Uh, that's okay. We want this one to go from here. We would like it to go to Chester. We then would like it to go to Crewe. And then we want it to head all the way to London and not really stop anywhere. So I think it goes on to here. Yes, it does. So let's have yet another line going into London, Houston. That looks good. Now we'll repaint the line on the way back. So crew is first stop. Crew, yep. Chester, yep. Uh, I forgot to add rail. Whoops. So banger. Add a station rail. Chester, add a station rail, and then back up to Bangor. There we go, we're all good. Uh, Autosave, yeah, I have been sort of milling around, fixing little bits here and there before I actually started this, but we'll get this done. So we actually need to check this line, it looks like it's trying to go up and down on the same, that's, that's really annoying, don't know why. Don't know why it wants to do that, but it's coming in on this platform here, which is totally fine. So that is numero uno. I want to select this train. So yeah, they're going down on the right. Okay, so 
Mine's Lane. Yeah. Would love to be able to get rid of all the other lanes here. Uh, I think some people have suggested there is a way to do it. Uh, at my game, it just does not work. I can't get rid of all this other lanes here. I only want to see the lane I am working on. And I would like it to maybe be an option to add on if there are other lanes possibly in the area. But rail here needs to go on too. Yeah, but now you're screwed up. Okay. I mean, it shouldn't be. It sh shouldn't be screwed up at all. So, yeah, go down on three on Chester. And then up on four. Yes. So that's fine. That is totally fine. It may be an issue that there's no diamond at the other side. Yes, that is, in fact, indeed, the issue. Uh, tracks... I'm still actually selecting Katanari for this. I may remove it all. Uh, it looks like we don't have any diesel trains. All right. Maybe, perhaps just maybe, the line has maybe sorted itself out. So it splits off there. Happy days. Goes to rail. Goes down here. Yes. Goes down there. Perfect. And then off into London, Houston. Oh, happy days. Right, there's a nice Singapore Airlines A380 rolling in there. Let's go buy vehicles. Uh, we want a diesel class 800. In Avanti West Coast, please. Where is the... Ah, they're there. They're there, they're there, they're there. So, what are these five? Uh, train bow. <laughs> uh, where's the Avanti? Wait, does Avanti West Coast not have a class? 800? I am pretty certain that they do. Huh, is it an electrics? Or is it perhaps one of these? It's it's maybe a Pendolino, yeah, a couple of Pendolinos there. That's okay, we do actually have a diesel multiple unit version. It's down here in the class one nine sixes. Right, so this is a three car unit. I'm gonna possibly go with a four car unit. If I can find one, yep, so add that, yep, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, that's a seven car unit, so <laughs> we've jumped up drastically there. Huh, no four car unit in Avanti West Coast, oh well, three car unit it is in, removeth this, add that, capacity of 54, it might be fine actually. Right, let's set you on a line then. So this will be line one. Right, off you pop, my friend. Oh, it's nice, nice A380. Coming in there. There we go, nice Avanti West Coast livery there. You're going to head off to Banger. Yes, you are. Right, so let's change this up as well. So line one uh, should actually be... Avanti West Ghost. And it should be... Bang to LDN. Right, excellent. Now we will obviously get a second one of these. Uh, did I buy a second one? No. Let's do that. So and that buy, and we shall get ready to to launch this accordingly once the other one is done. Yes. Yeah, so these are Pendolinos. There's no class 800 Avanti West Coast. That's a shame. Ah oh, well. We've got these. These are nice. 
They are looking kind of dirty. Okay, right, before we go and do buses and stuff and wheels, we're going to fix some stuff up here. So we added a lot of bread and wheat and stuff to this. Right, push pause. Are you empty, my friend? You are. Okay, so there is RDT Green Wick Inver. So I want you to go to RDT Green Wick Inver. Green Wick Inver. Okay. Alright, I want this one to do the same. So RDT Green Wick Inver. And then I may even add this third one. So RDT Green Wick Inver. Ooh, there. Okay, right. Wick Inver, and then we're going to manage the line. And up here at Wick West, we're going to set you to wait for a full load. I believe the first couple of trucks here should actually get the full load. Uh, you are a Thurzo RV. Okay, this should have ramped up, or should be at least trying to ramp up. Looks like these guys are coming in here as well. That's okay, we just wanted to free up uh, a bit of space over here. And then we might have to do the same over here. Now, there is Green Wick Thurzo and Green Wick Avi. Okay. So, these ones will probably get stuck. Uh, I should maybe set you to wait for a full load. I don't think I need as much of these man trucks on here. This one's full, which is nice. This one's empty, right? I'm going to remove with you, my friend. Green Wick Thurzo, manage line. Uh, Wick Exchange, yep. Hello, hello, hello. That was weird. That was really weird. I've never seen that before. Uh, anywho, what is happening over here? So these guys are trying to fill up. This guy will also be filling up. I don't know why we're not getting as much over here, but we will investigate this. So the first one, Thorzo to Avi. Yeah, so this one is taking stuff for for the old booze train. And I was thinking about upgrading the good old booze train. Now one of the things I want to do is I want to wait for the trains down here. In fact, push pause, right, this is scary. Ooh, delete that. Delete that, delete that, delete all this, that, that, that. That as well, yep, go. Everything here must go because we are going to try and get a larger roundabout in here. Now, this is going to have to go, and so is that. So many things are going to break here. Many things. Okay, let's do the roundabout first. So it was suggested that we get a three-lane roundabout, make it slightly bigger, in order for this to, in order for this to work. Now I very much agree that this is definitely the way to go. Now I'm going to place that there, right? Let's have a look. This will sort of maybe fix, potentially resolve any traffic issues we have in future. I mean, that could go there. Uh, this would have to go up here. Now the problem is, is that does that look bad? No, it's not too bad. And that can go there, right? And then we can still get the station in here. We're gonna have to connect that to there. That kind of looks bad, but I will <laughs> allow it to be a, to be a thing. Right, train stations, buildings. Right here goes nothing. Adding this one back in. Now it was a four. Yep. Spin it around. 
Okay, 240. Let's expand it again. Don't think uh, we could possibly. Possibly make it a 320. Right, I'm going to delete this back as well. And then we'll see. Because some of these trains are quite long. Ooh, look at that. Catanary, no, because we're up in the north. Uh, I'm going to go there. And see how this looks. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Catanary, no. It's slightly off. Am I concerned that it is slightly off? Uh, no. All I wanted was to get that roundabout in there. And the roundabout is now a thing. Right, it looks like something... RLF Combat Stone Inverness. Manage line. Uh, so remove Inverness East. Add a station there. Uh, that potentially didn't do what we wanted it to do. No, it is. It is. It's fine. It's fine. You can come down with 50 meat. That's awesome. And everything should be okay. Potentially. We want to make sure there are no traffic lights or anything here. And stuff should just be able to go. There we go. Right, you did not unload your grain. Ah, I think you're going down here somewhere. That's fine. Right, we're going to need grain. It looks like the fish and stuff is now over here. It was over there. Alright, so this one is good. Fuel inver, also good. You've gone onto that platform as well. You've gone onto this platform. Yeah, I want... Yeah, yeah, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I do actually want this to go over here. So... Manage line. Inverness East going on three. There we go, there we go, there we go. Right, there you go. Have your stuff, my friend. Uh, train. The, probably this train here because I, I changed something in the station and the game absolutely, truly despises that. It, it truly does. It really hates when you change stuff. All I did, actually, was change stuff. To make it easier for this train in the game when, uh, no. Haha, <laughs> it's not closed the doors. The animation there. Uh, we'll let it come out, right, and then I'm going to let it go back in. And that should be that. Done, really. Right, so get past the junction. Alright, and then turn around and go back. Right, it should go in and then start that loading, loading animation again. Uh, we did lose a lot of stuff, but it's okay. Right, so as far as things go for delivery here, we're not capturing everything, but that's okay. I'm not going to go into severe uh, micromanagement mode for stuff like that. Cities expand all the time unless you sort of barrier them off or cap them and there are cities where industries and commercial buildings sort of get placed just sort of randomly around which is kind of true in real life uh, like the house I used to stay in uh, back in Fraserburgh was in a heavy built residential area and not far from it was a primary school and there was a shopping area, there was a shop, uh, like a newsagent 
<laughs> there was a shop that was like a sweet shop because it was obviously right next to school. There was a hairdresser's, a hair, a, a hair salon, a fish and chip shop, a, a Chinese takeaway. And you do get commercial buildings sort of in built up residential areas. But the level of micromanagement it would take you to cover absolutely everything is phenomenal. So we're not gonna we're not gonna stress about that too much. All I really wanted was for this to run smoothly and not to have a huge queue of traffic heading down here and this will potentially aid that. Hopefully. We'll see. I mean, it was kind of working fine before because we capped a lot of trucks to to sit over here and wait, basically. See, the problem is we have set these man trucks to wait for a full load and I deleted one because nothing was happening. Uh, now it's sort of ramped up again. This might do the same. Uh, we'll have to just sort of wait and see. We've got two Scania variants of this. I might delete one. Let's take a bit of pressure off this line. Where are you going? You're going to there. 32, you're at 25. Yeah, this needs to... All this needs to do is ramp up. Once this one moves, it should be good. And our grain train should actually start to get stuff. Uh, we are 253, so yeah, that's a lot of livestock. So we could possibly add, yeah, there's some way, manage vehicle. Uh, duplicate that, yep, so that gives us two. Duplicate that, yes, gives us four. And pick one more and duplicate that, gives us five. So they will launch from somewhere and go to there. And we should get more cows being delivered over here but the train has to deal with cows and fish so it should be fine it should run decently sort of full uh, what is going on over here there is 41 alcohol grain is still being delivered so do I need to add more alcohol trucks to this where is the next one these are all grain trucks we do have uh, we've got the Kine Nagel. That's coming in. That will take 52. So that will basically wipe out everything here. And this should all be set to wait at Elgin West. We'll set them to wait for full load. No point having them run back basically empty. But yeah, you've got 160 stored. You've got 171. Yeah, they are sort of burning through it. Hopefully this will get up to 52, and then this one will just be able to go. And then what's this one again? Carlsberg? Or some sort of beer? I do recognize this. Yeah, it's obviously like Danish beer or something. <laughs> but it's okay. Right, so did you get a full load? my friend. I don't really want to tamper with the alcohol line, it seems kind of fine. I may have to tamper, tamper with it at the other end, down at the Carlisle end. But we'll just sort of wait and see. Alright, so you own the car 25. There's already three. You will carry 25 as well, so that's fine. And two compartments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're all good here. We shall leave the alcohol. Now, food down here. Alright, so these guys are picking up grain. Okay, so we definitely need manage line. In fact, manage vehicles. Oh, wait. You just picked up a crap ton of stuff as well. Yeah, you should be picking up livestock and stuff, though. <laughs> uh, that's okay. Is it okay? Is it okay to have this like that? Possibly. Where is the next truck? 
you're roughly about there. You've got one meat to bring back, which is fine. But this here, grain for Perth, right? We'll manage the vehicles. We will duplicate them again. And off they go on their merry way. Now, we're not bringing bread back. So the bread factory here has nothing to do. It has grain. It looks like it is consuming some things. Meat is being delivered here, which is fine. But we need to actually find where the bread needs to go. So some wants to go back up to Wick and Thurzo. Uh, that's going to be interesting. Is there any closer? Edinburgh, Dundee, Aberdeen perhaps? No. So I think it's Wick, Thurzo and the other places down here at Ayr. So let's have a look. We have trucks delivering things to here, right? They are currently residing in here, and it's combat and fuel, which I suppose is fine. What's this for? RDT, Grain, Wick, Inverness. And that's just a small one. Okay, what is this? That is meat for Inverness. So if I could get another one of these in, again, potentially uh, crippling. Oh, we need a we need a fuel train to arrive imminently. Do you have anything on board? Seven. Yeah, just uh, just go. Grove Road. Just allow these stone tree uh, stone trucks to get in. Ooh, that bus doesn't like that. Okay. <laughs> okay, so let's actually check Thurzo, right? So Thurzo is heading up here. Okay, so the, the drop off point is right there. So click on that. Go into here. Buildings. Uh, does it cover any of the bread? Yeah, they need bread here. They sort of need bread over there. I think we're good. I think if we just tell the train to drop stuff off, trucks will take bread back up there. That'll give us more sort of needed grain throughput. There's the grain train right there. It takes 325. It's uh, it's not going to get 325. Not by a, not by a long shot. But if we start adding bread, so pick up this train. Right, manage the line. So at Dundee, Annex, Inverness, Aberdeen, Aviemore South, right? Load up on bread also, right? And uh, Inverness, you are unloading meat and bread. Right, so that will now send a signal to the train that it can pick up bread down here. Uh, so it looks like meat is waiting, but it should start to add bread. Uh, this will realize that bread can now be pushed out. Probably at this platform and these trucks will take it back. Yeah, 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 and they can take stuff over two compartments, which is fine. Very nice. So that should be good. We're unloading meat at Dundee. It's got 74 of 171. It's got some comm mats. It's got some fuel. And we're kind of happy. That was an area I wanted to clean up. I also wanted to get uh, bread down here. But how, how does one do that? I'm thinking perhaps out this way. Run it along here. Maybe along there and then bridge onto here. Right, that at least takes it down to there. We could potentially get a road or something up here and then deliver it down there. I mean, are you even going to attempt to go around here and then into there? 
perhaps, maybe, that can perhaps maybe be, perhaps maybe be another episode. How are you getting on? 68 of 90? Oh, I've paused it. Yeah, you're empty though. What's this? Uh, combats. Alcohol? Yes, alcohol. 26 of 32. Uh, yeah, that'll fill that up. And this will be able to go. Are you holding anyone up? No, you are not. Nice. Yeah, so in another episode, we'll take a freight train uh, down via here, and we'll get trucks to take bread into air. That will, again, give this more demand for throughput over here. Are we getting bread yet? No. Did you pick up bread? No. It has produced some consumers. Uh, what can Thurzo? Is it one? Two? There's no way you've taken bread back already. No shot. I don't believe it. I just see meat here. Oh, there's a bread. Oh, happy days. Okay. <laughs> So that's good, that's gonna, that stuff is going to get moved. This truck looked like it picked up almost everything. Uh, the grain trucks are doing well as well. Uh, there's no point setting them to wait for a full load here. This road is not particularly massively busy at the moment. It seems fine, actually. So, let's do another thing. Right, let's go... back down to London Houston and find out where my Avanti West Coast Welsh train is. Who are you? Hold trains? Uh, that's King's Cross. So yeah, you when are you? You're up there. You're heading for Chester. That's fine. Alright, so we'll just launch the the next one. Uh, fire you on there. Off you go. Change this up to red. Now why is it? Every of this Cathay Pacific plane is well below stall speed. 83 miles per hour, no way. That's crazy. Is that another Singapore Airlines 747? Yeah, that's cool. I do like the planes. There's a 2 -E plane taking off. Right, you are ready to go. So off to the west, to Wales, you go. Right, what is happening over here? Right, we've got a stagecoach bus here. There are new stagecoach liveries, which are really nice. We've got two stagecoach buses there. My god, let's not push the boat out too much. However, let's go into here. Uh, seven is fine. That's fine. Yep, yep. What I would like, though, is a route that goes around here. So possibly jumping on this and that. We'll maybe have it go to fewer stops, but I also want one down here at Sunderland. Uh, now there's no bus heading out here at the moment to the airport so there's not really apart from the 291 people that want to go to Holland that makes sense. Uh, it's, it's always a popular flight and uh, the flight to Amsterdam. Right let's add a bus here right so streets buildings by era right I think it would be nice just to sort of sit off the edge here Alright, so you, hello, hello, calm down there, game, auto save again, so we've been playing for roughly about half an hour, just over half an hour, because I've got them saved to, or have I got them set to half an hour, hmm, hmm, right, build that please, yes, please and thank you, buildings, let's get a bus, right, Right, bus station there, so that's covered. 
I want I need to really upgrade some of these roads. Right, we're gonna have it come to this side of Manchester. Go about there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so a new line. And uh, new line, please. And this is something I've been meaning to do for ages. Buses. There are so many areas where I do not have any bus routes at all. And I'll go to there now. I was kind of hoping most of this would be covered, but I'm now thinking. Streets, buildings, yeah. Maybe get one of them right there. That also covers the airport, so no one might actually use this, but we'll see. We'll see. Line one, manage line, add a station, that. It is on the right side, right? It is. Right, change it up to yellow. Now. Hold the fort because I don't actually know which bus to place on here. Uh, buy vehicles. We've got one in here. A tease and district. Right now, tease and district I am going to use, but I'm going to use that double decker to run between first Glasgow, Leeds, first bus, St. Paul, St. Paul City, first bus, Vantage. Okay, I think we go with, because it's possibly more than likely going to be stagecoach, but the, the newer liveries. So the current stagecoach livery, uh, passengers, make life easier for yourself. Where are they? Hello, new stagecoach liveries, where are thou? Wait. Where are they? I had them. I definitely had them. Over the top. Negative. Negatory. Uh, let's go down then. National Express, UK operators, Mercedes Benz, Route Master. Yada yada yada. Yada yada yada. Yada yada yada. Now. Where are the new stagecoach with read buses. Uh, is it just because I'm going past them? Uh, UK operators, right, try that. First bus, Manchester, Ipswich. First bus, custom, full of travel, Chambers bus, Arriva Standard, Arriva Sapphire. First bus, West Lothian. Ah. Could use that in Glasgow area. First bus Steel Express, first bus Star V1. I think they're in here, yeah. Stagecoach, 2020 local beach ball. Yeah, this is the one that they have where I live. Stagecoach Gold, Taff Valley Coaches. Swindon. Transport for Wales. No, transport for West Midlands. <laughs> close, 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 but no cigar. Right, we're going to use the local livery. I right, buy one of these. Uh, beach ball version 1, beach ball version 2. I'm going to go with this, the 2021 as well. So select that and that. Right, place you on line one. Perfect. So they're gonna roll out. And these are nice liveries as well. Oh, there's one. Ah, so it's a Mercedes. I don't think the the buses where I live are Mercedes. But they do have this livery. This uh, circle at the back, stagecoach. So off they go on their merry way. And now, what we want to do is create a large line, right? So change this as stage 
coach uh, son give me your Sunderland give me your off they go nice 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 and then we want to create a new route and this is just going to be literally the T's area so one two three four five go there six there's nothing over here see that's something I wanted to kind of I think I wanted to remedy so get one about over here and get one about there yes they are going down those hideous streets that we hate or I hate but it's okay so it's going to there add a station to that At Mill Road. Ah, it's it's okay. It's because it was it was almost the same color as a right Grove Road. Add that. Add that. I want you to go there. Go down there. Go to there. Be as well go to here, there, and then back to there. And this will basically be a T's line. So T's. We'll say T's bus. Uh, new slash sun. Okay, we'll paint that yellow as well. Now I want this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six is fine. Six is a nice number. So T's bus. R S T. Let's go. Now the game will take fifty million years and decide whether it wants them to be part of the game. It did, and then we'll uh, we'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. Actually, got some new buses on. We got the the London to Houston, Great North Radio T's. I mean, these Leyland Olympias are old, but the livery does suit the area, so it's quite nice. And people will actually be able to come out of the airport and use these buses which is also nice and that's kind of the feel that we're going for here it's not totally accurate we could have done a total I could have researched every single bus and where it comes from and every single town etc but this is just a casual playthrough at the moment we will do something more What's the word we're looking for? Serious? On a more authentic scale later on. Uh, but not this time. So we're looking for transport for Wales. Banger of London. There we go. Heading down. London transfer. Nice easy route for you there. Nothing much to stand in your way. Uh, where is the other one? is currently departing for Chester. Nice. But we'll leave it there for that episode. Uh, tomorrow we'll be back on to doing maybe freight and passenger lines, etc. And then later on we'll do a bit more of a cleanup episode. Like, there's no bus for crew yet. We need to get a bus for crew. People are going to the station, but it's just these people that are in range. Uh, we want everything to sort of, sort of kind of work, if you know what I mean. But we'll leave it there for that episode. As always, if you did watch this and you would like to leave a like, comment or dislike, please feel free to do so. And if there is more you would like to see in the future, then hit the subscribe button. I've been Danny Boy, this has been Transport Fever 2 on the UK map, and I will catch you later.